is one of the most famous hotels in the world, the Raffles Hotel in Singapore, and I'm on the trail of a tiger. Well, there used to be quite a few wild tigers in Singapore, but what's one doing in the middle of a famous hotel? It's a bit of a mystery. Now, that's what I was looking for, unmistakable tiger tracks. Now, what's this all about? Well, Raffles Hotel in its hundred years has played host to many famous people, kings and queens and princes and film stars, the lot. So you can imagine the consternation when, in 1902, as everybody was sitting around enjoying themselves, the cry went out, there's a tiger in the hotel. Well, in those days, headmasters were made of pretty rough stuff. So Mr. Phillips, the local headmaster, grabbed his shotgun and went through the hotel, tracking the tiger the way I have been. And he caught it here, in Raffles' billiard room. In fact, it was hiding just underneath this table. And there, I'm afraid, Mr. Phillips shot it. Well, this year, coincidentally, is the Year of the Tiger in China. And it's Raffles' 100th birthday, so it's known as the Year of the Tiger at Raffles. But what about these footprints on the floor? What are they doing? Well, the legend now is so famous that the manager has painted on the floor the tracks of the tiger to show the path it took as it came into the hotel. And if you follow those tracks today, you'll end up with another mystery. Many famous authors used to stay here, and still do. And in the days of the tiger, a lot of them were English. And the barman who worked here decided he was going to invent for them a drink that they would absolutely love. He did, this is it, and he called it the Singapore Sling. And it's not really a drink for you. This one, however, is, and its ingredients are still a mystery. It's been developed for children and it's called the Singapore Explorer. It comes in its own Singapore Explorer cup and it has a topi lid. And if you lift that lid and peer inside, although it looks delicious, it's a mystery in there too. Because nobody knows, apart from the raffles, how to make one of these. Lots of people have tried to guess what's in it. No one has yet succeeded. So if you're ever here, come and have one. You may solve the mystery. At any event, you'll be having a drink of Singapore history. Cheers.